Hi guys, Frozen and welcome back to another episode of Nights of Dragons. Before we actually begin this video, I want to give a little uh, shout out to my other video of yesterday, Clash Royale, guys. If you if you like it, just try it. Try to watch it at least. You know, I, I've seen a much of much people actually try it, and I'm glad that I actually liked it. You know, no dislikes. That that about that I don't really care. You know, it's just about the people who like it that I care about. So we are going to do an epic balls of review so last week I actually said like Gree is fucking up my second season but apparently they are not because what actually happened is I started Epic Balls reviews around a year ago or something no oh, I, I don't know when I started the Epic Balls reviews but I remember that Kamaitashi and the first couple of epi epic Epic Ballses I didn't do those so let's just go ahead and do him, I guess. So we have Galforce Wargas and Armor. Is that thing behind his back? That is a weapon? Like Kamatashi's weapon? Is, is it behind his back? Let's just take a look at it. I'll just put it to oh, there for a moment. Why is he with having that scythe behind his back? Like, why? Why? That is an odd pose. Let, let me tell you that. That is an odd pose right there. Like. Why do you put your weapon behind your... Is that how you can be more agile and fast or something? I don't know. I've, I've never played with a scythe before and I think I don't think I should do it. <laughs> because if, if I do it, not many people will survive it. So yeah, there, there was also this guy that said at level 62 you'll get 50 Shadow Forge materials. Uh, the, the 50 materials you'll, you'll, you see here are actually the materials of Gale Force Wire Gear. So level 62 is basically just another armor. So after level 60 I should just you should stop if you are looking for some Shadow Forge. Yes, this is actually the first time in years that I've done level 18, 18 just because of these Shadow Forge materials. I'm really going for it right now. But yeah, the, these things, as you can see, they're right here as well. And otherwise we would have gone and drag of, or Shadow Forge a long time ago. So yeah, let's go ahead and see what it's actually about. This is uh, this type of boss is mono air. I don't know if Kamei Tashi, if I like pronounce it correctly. I don't know. We'll see. If I don't pronounce it correctly, you guys will probably bitch in the comments like, oh, you didn't say it like that. No, you say it like this, you idiot, and blah blah blah. Because we all know how that works, uh, how the YouTube community works by now. So yeah, I just did three levels, by the way. How the f I did I did like three levels of them. Um, like half an hour ago, how the fuck does he regen regenerate that fast? How does he do that? Like I, I had like four energy and half an hour ago, and now it's already filled up again. I did not buy jack shit. I am not buying any energy for it. Like arena, apple balls, raid ball. Yeah, of course when I'm on a run, but I'm not on a run, you know. So yeah, what I really like about this thing is that it's I don't know if it, it's is it a big furry or something it's it's a big animal with a weapon with a scythe and a scythe is pretty much one of the one of my favorite weapons of all time to use in any video game basically because they of course they are quite slow to use that that, that is uh, true they are quite slow to use but if you do some damage on them you do a fuck ton of damage, let me tell you that. I don't know if there's any uh, guy with a scythe in Clash Royale, but if if there is, like uh, Satan or something, he is in my deck. I can guarantee you that. And also, guys, another episode of Clash Royale will be up later on tonight. Because by the time you guys will see this... So yeah, let me know what you think about this epic boss. Uh, my... Uh, I really say this a little recap or a shortened version. Really like this epic boss because it's just a I don't know I don't know what animal it is actually, but it's just a it's just a great epic boss to look at. You know, only the post is a little bit weird to play with a scythe. I mean, I have seen people who actually did it, who actually uh, how do you say that? Fault people with a stick behind their back. You know. They had a stick on, uh, on, uh, they had a, they grabbed the stick, put it behind their arms, and just, then just killed the entire screen with 
damn, just a damn stick. Behind, all behind the arms. So I think that's pretty much what he's trying to do here. So the plus plus is still shit for the 4100, 42 or something, 44, 40, 4000, I don't know. 4144, four, four, I think the total stats are. I don't know, don't have a calculator with me. I actually have a calculator with me, but I'm not going to use it because I'm too lazy. So guys, can we get like 7 likes for this Epic Walls review? You guys have always been... Oh, for crying out loud, let's, let's just thank... I'll just thank you for the support, alright? So guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later in the next video. Bye bye!